on a regular basis, I have people ask me how to publish their book, how to get their book up on Amazon, how to make it alive, how to go ahead and get all that done. Let's talk about that today. I'm going to share with you a strategy about how to get your book up on Amazon before it's written. And the subject of today's episode is called uh, pre-launch, how to pre-launch your book on Amazon. I know you're going to love the show. Cowboy. Welcome to a daily dose of greatness class with your host, Trevor Crane, my dad. He is going to help you take your life and business to the next level. Here I come to save the day. Trevor Crane here, 11-time number one best-selling author and the founder of Epic Author Publishing, coming to you live every day so you can plug in every day to build your ideal business so you can live your ideal life. If my daddy can do it, then anybody can do it because he's a weirdo. You're supposed to make me sound cool. <laughs> Okay, so uh, this is a strategy that I learned from my mentor, my first book mentor that kind of hooked me up uh, and, and said, okay, stop doing those things. Like, this is really important to get from my mentor. He said, hey, brother. And I got this from his coaching, his course, and his community. He didn't actually say these specific words to me. I want to be clear. So when you buy somebody's coaching program, when you buy somebody's community, when you buy access to their help, I think you should kind of uh, learn from their shit. You don't have to actually be on a private conversation with them to be able to have them tell you this. <laughs> so, but I learned it through him, so I still got it through him. Okay, so I'm giving it to you now. I hope what I give you right now, you use. That's the only thing I'm going to give as far as the pregame here. It's a waste of time if you listen to what I'm about to share with you and you don't use it. However. If you're anything like me, I gotta say one more thing. <laughs> if you're anything like me, you might need more help. Like I needed the whole program, the whole protocol. You know, just giving me one piece to the puzzle wasn't my answer. I needed all the pieces to the puzzle. I needed the whole damn map. So when I say I'm gonna give you exactly how to do it, you absolutely can do it. But if it's only feeling like you don't have the whole the whole puzzle, the whole map, I get it because that's what I needed. I needed more help, someone to hold my hand and be accountable with me and. And give me the team that I needed access to. That's why I created my Epic Author Publishing Company. Okay, so you know you've already got that help if you need it, but let's get into how to get your book up on Amazon and how to use this strategy of pre-launching because it's really cool and I'm not going to hold anything back, but I'm going to be really sh brief too because we don't have to go into this long. It's just this is how you do it. It's really simple. So number one, you can upload your book to Amazon, partner with them as a billion-dollar company. Now listen to that. You can upload your book on Amazon. They want to sell you your stuff. They want to sell you. I don't know if they sell humans, <laughs> but they want to sell your book. And they would love to go ahead and uh, handle all of the logistics. They will even, if you properly keyword your book and put it in the right categories, even before it's written, just your book idea and concept, you can put up on Amazon and they'll sell it for you. And they'll market it for you and they'll promote it for you and they'll try to and they'll collect the money for you and they'll pay you your percentage. Now, you got two choices when you upload your book on Amazon. You can put it up for uh, I think they pay you 30 percent or 70 percent of what you sell it for. So you get to pick and it is based on I don't even understand the why the distinction really between them. Um, oh, if it's if it's under a certain amount of money, you're only allowed to get uh, 30 percent. And if it's over a certain amount of money, you're only allowed to get you can you can uh, get 70 percent. So it actually depends on how much you sell your book for. But right now, let's just say you put it up and you put it up for 10 bucks. Keep it really simple. OK, put it up for 10 bucks. Um, I typically have my authors put their books up for 20 dollars when they pre-launch, because when we're pre-launching, we're establishing um, our book up on Amazon and we're making a declaration to the world and we're doing some promotion and we tell people, oh my God, look, my book is up, it's there. And we put it up initially to just make sure we figured out all the logistics and you get to test your marketing with Amazon. When your book is up available for pre-launch, it's just a description of your book and it's a cover. And what they also ask you to do is come up with the date. Now, I've mentioned this before on some of my other podcasts. I have this in my course and program. And I go into every little element and step and detail here. 
but all you got to really do to get your book up logistically before you uh, contact Amazon and upload it is you need to get what I call the three D's. Okay. Design your cover, describe your book and pick a date. That's it. So if you're listening right now and you want to write it and you want to get a book up on Amazon and you want to be how to blank, how to tie your shoes, how to do this, how to do that. And a great title, by the way, could be how to blank without blank. Okay. So that's a really good title. And I have a, an episode I did just recently about how to pick a great title. And if you go back and look at that, I go into some detail. I was walking around Target and I did a video where I was looking at other pick other titles and I uh, said that you can do the same thing and you can go watch that episode and you can kind of come up with some cool titles based on number one best selling titles and then you kind of tweak it to make it yours. So now if you title your co- title your book, you now need to just upload it or not upload it. Answer these three D's. So now you've got the how to blank without blank or you've modeled the four hour work week and you've made yours the seven hour abs or whatever your thing is. OK, see how I did that? I took the set four hour work week. And I changed the uh, number and I changed the deliverable. The four hour work week turned into the seven hour abs. I got a book title. Now, the three D's design a cover. And if you go to trevorcrane.com forward slash resources, I have a lot of uh, free resources there. And that's where I have some of my design places. I go for design and you can find them all there. I could give you a ton more links and go, hey, go here, go here, go here. Go to trevorcrane.com forward slash resources. There's some free stuff there you can go ahead and find and then pick design and you can pick one of those links. And whether you spend a little bit of money, five bucks or a hundred bucks or a thousand bucks, you can find some options on getting your cover done or you can just design it on your own and now you have a cover. Okay, so that is the design your cover. The next thing is to describe your book. So describe your book. You already know the title. And then I answer four questions when I'm looking at how to design my cover and look at my uh, description. And it's who is the book for? What is it about? Why would people care? And the why people would care are typically problems and results. So so I think about the top top 10 problems, top 10 results that people want that I'm going to answer in this book. And you write that stuff down. And then the, the fourth question is, what do you want them to do next? And if you ask and answer those four questions, and if you need to pause this podcast and go back and write those down, those are the four questions, or go read the uh, transcript, and you'll see that I've got those questions written out for you from today's show. Those are the four questions you ask and answer. And if you can do that in your description, you've now described your book. And now the last thing you need is just to pick a date. Now, the date for you is the day that you upload your book to Amazon But you also want to look at the date that your book is finally going to be delivered because this is a pre-launch, which is a pre-sale. And so in order to pre-sale your book, pre-sell your book, you have to promise Amazon that you're going to deliver this book within a certain time frame. So when you're looking at the date element, it's like, hey, are you going to do this on a Saturday? Are you going to figure out how to upload it next Saturday? And you're going to have your book up because it's just the description And they'll ask you to put up a file of your cover, a file of your summary and description of your book. That's your like working manuscript, even though it's just a short description, it's still okay. And you now, when you put it up there, they say, when do you want to deliver this book? Now, this is where the rubber meets the road. This is where it can be really scary because you're like, "Uh oh, (laughs) I now got to write this sucker. And the answer is yes. So I typically don't advise that you do all of the things I just described until you figured out like how to write your book and get the path and the plan to write a freaking great book and make sure that you get it done really quickly because it can be very overwhelming. I have one of my clients right now sent me a message recently and she was kind of freaking out. She's like, hey, uh, I only have three months left to get my book done. She spent three months in promotion trying to grow her business, adding new clients, interviewing people, doing some cool things for her business and her brand. She's like, Trev, I only have three months left. I still have to pre-launch. I still have to uh, to write my book. I still have to have it edited and formatted. I'm like, hey, girl, just remember, day one, we talked about this, that you this was this was the process. This is the process I suggest. You can totally get this done. You've done so much work. I understand you're nervous and you're putting pressure on yourself, but my daughter is nervous about entering the 
sixth grade. Like it's freaking her out and I know she can handle it and you can handle it too. So I work with my clients for typically six months, if not a year. I've got two programs. One's a six month program and one's a 12 month program. And I help them throughout that process. Just do one step at a time. That doesn't mean you won't feel pressure to get your book done. You totally will. Uh, it doesn't mean that it has to kill you, though. It's not hard. Like, my daughter still goes to school the same hour she went last year, for the most part. And she gets a little bit of homework when she comes home. Not that overwhelming. But she freaks her out because it's new. <laughs> and when you're becoming an author, it freaks us out as well. And sometimes uh, when you're looking at getting your book done, I know that myself, I had a whole lot wrapped up in it. I didn't want to look stupid. And uh, <laughs> so I wanted my book to be awesome. And I needed help, which is why I provide that help. But real quickly, uh, we're just about at the end of this. I'm just kind of telling you what else to expect. If you upload your book on Amazon, like I just described, that is you picking a date. They give you 90 days at maximum to get your book done, like I said. And now your book can be up. And it gives you 90 days to write it. Now, my clients typically write their book in 30 days or less. I spend the first month or two or three helping them with marketing and promotion and turning their book into the most powerful marketing tool and then getting clarity around their message and adding clients about and around their message that they can showcase results for inside their book so that they're so congruent around their content. And I help them with their table of contents and what the structure of a great story is. And I do all that stuff with you in our, on our Epic Author Publishing Program. But for you, since all we're really talking about today is just how to get your book up on Amazon, that's about it. Uh, on the logistics of how to go to Amazon to find out how to upload it and do all that, um, I would just advise that you invest in Epic Author Publishing. It will help you. Or you can go to uh, YouTube and you can probably Google how to do it. You can probably go on to Amazon. You can search and they'll probably have some how-tos about how to do it. I will say that if you want to become a number one bestseller, uh, there are some logistics when it comes to the actually what buttons to press when you upload your book on Amazon. That if you if you click the wrong button, if you don't do if you click, I don't even know which ones they are anymore because I have someone on my team who's our um, Amazon expert, and she does this for us. Because if you click the wrong button and you think it makes total sense <laughs> to click a button and say, oh, my book is going to be like this, or my book is going to be like that, you can take yourself, you can uh, kind of hurt yourself to, when it comes to positioning your book to become a number one bestseller. Um, because you lose some controls. And I don't even remember which buttons you've got to click, but... Again, the cool thing is in Epic Author Publishing, we show you how. There's a module in my program that shows you which buttons to click and which ones not to click just so that you are still positioned so you can do some phenomenal marketing for your book and you can move, put your book everywhere. Uh, on, the problem is, is that there's a difference between marketing your book only on Amazon and having the ability to market your book everywhere. So I don't know about you, but this is pretty exciting stuff. You know, I, I thought the publishing my book was really hard. And there are a lot of hard elements of making something amazing. It typically takes a group of people to build an amazing house. You know, you're, there's rarely just one guy or one gal that's out there with a hammer figuring it out. So I don't recommend you do it on your own, not if you're going to be really impressed with the final result. But I'm pretty excited that you now have the, the how-to when it comes to how to put your book up on Amazon and use the power of this how to pre-launch your book on Amazon and you now understand one of the rules when it comes to you have up to 90 days to get her done. Now the last thing I'll go ahead and tease here and maybe tomorrow I'll record a podcast about how to become a number one bestseller is that I like to do some promotion to go ahead and position my book when we upload it so that it becomes a number one bestseller and have a whole bunch of people go buy my book. I mean, why put your book up on Amazon if nobody's going to find it and read it? Now, like I said, Amazon will do some marketing for you, but you've got to help them out. Like if you don't meet their algorithm, if you don't properly position your book on their platform, they're not going to know how to promote you and support you, and they're not going to double down on their marketing for you, uh, where they will actually send messages to people, uh, send emails to people, who have bought similar books like yours, who are searching for topics like yours, and they will go ahead and say, hey, this is a hot new release. You should go get it. Like, isn't that cool? 
You can do this just in the United States. You can do, do this across all their platforms across the whole uh, world. So it's pretty cool. I'm going to talk about that tomorrow because I think you might like that. And then I highly suggest that you get some help with this whole process instead of trying to do it yourself. Today is definitely a very simplistic uh, description of how to, but it is a very accurate one. So I love you. Can't wait to talk to you. Can't wait to meet you in Epic Author Publishing. If you haven't done so lately, you should check out our new webinar at epicauthor.com. And I can't wait to see you tomorrow. Another daily dose of Greatness Quest. Later. To get even more awesomeness, which means all my best stuff, download my app by texting Trevor to 36260. It will show up right on your cell phone. Just text message the word Trevor to 36260. Talk to you soon.